Seven tips. Also this morning, police are investigating a six vehicle crash. It happened out in East New York, Brooklyn. The wreck involved an MTA bus it left more than a dozen people injured. Let's get right to Fox 5's Briella Tomasetti. She is live in Brooklyn with more. Good morning, Briella. Yeah, to Shawnee and Dan, good morning to both of you. This is no longer an active scene, but it is very much so an active investigation. Uh, B-15 buses have been bypassing this stop pretty much all morning. Also, neighbors have been calling for a traffic light to be placed at this intersection. They say it is incredibly dangerous. What we noticed, a lot of people have been rolling right through those stop signs. We was waiting for the 15 Everywhere. coming this way. We, were, we, we was, was waiting for the B-15 just and now. And we was wondering, we was like, we, we like, why like, the bus not coming? Bus? The B-15 never showed last night because it was involved in a chain reaction crash that injured more than a dozen people. According to the NYPD, the accident happened just before 8.30 at the intersection of New Lots Avenue and Essex Street in East New York. Citizen app captured the aftermath. One by one, mangled cars were strewn across the street with sirens wailing in the background. Firefighters can be seen pulling one passenger out of the back seat of a white sedan who appeared to be unresponsive and assisting passengers off the bus onto stretchers. It's more cars on the other side. MTA officials say the bus was en route to JFK Airport when a car crashed into it. Six vehicles were involved, injuring a total of 15 people. Most of them were taken to Brookdale and Downstate Hospitals to be evaluated. A 44-year-old woman is in critical condition. The bus operator, in the meantime, was also assisted by EMS workers. A lot of stuff that happened around my block, not just here. So I'm guessing it's just because the summertime and the weather is really right. getting hot. Bruce Vera lives just a couple blocks away. He rushed to the scene because his mother typically rides the B-15, but was relieved to find out she wasn't on board. I could just imagine how other families are. Like how they're feeling right now if their family members got hurt in this accident. Many have called for a traffic light to be installed at the busy intersection, which currently has just two stop signs. Others attributed the crash to reckless driving, a problem which often tends to escalate when the weather gets warmer. People got to be more careful. We got to drive careful. Yep, and as I mentioned, the exact cause of this crash remains under investigation. An important thing to piece into this, though, is that all drivers who were involved, they remained on scene afterwards. For now, though, we're live in East New York. Dan and Tashani, back to you. All right, we'll figure out what happened. Thank you very much, Briella. Time now.